this has been the single biggest investment from um, the SIF funds, and that has been to create matching programs for um, scholarships, student scholarships, and matching programs for professorships. Um, the degree of matching has varied um, over time and depending on the kind of scholarship and the kind of professorship, but the basic idea is simple, that we will match at a to a certain extent, either 50% or up to 100%, of a donation that creates a student scholarship or a student or, or a faculty professorship. Um, and just to give you a sense of the numbers, um, over uh, the last five or six years when we started this, um, we have been able to generate um, $380 million in donations for student scholarships and have matched that with $270 million for a total of $650 million um, for student scholarships. To give you a sense of the impact of this, there are 700 new scholarship endowments. Um, and over the last four years, the percentage of students who are on donor-funded need-based scholarships has increased by 170%. Um, we've been equally successful on the professorship side, um, and there we've been able to raise $316 million from donors um, we have um, contributed $212 million in matching funds for a total of $530 million of an impact. Um, to give you a sense of the professorships that have been established, these are chaired professorships, um, we've raised money for over 130 um, professorships. Um, that's a rate of 20 plus a year. Just to give you some comparison, Prior to this matching program, we were raising, correct me if I'm wrong, Mark, um, funds for four to five professorships a year. What's the cost of a professorship now? It varies, and that's the, that's the last point I'll make. Um, it varies by school, so it's basically pegged to cover a large portion or the totality of someone's salary. Um, and that varies from school to school. There's a difference between arts and sciences, for example, and Darden and the law school. Um, but the range is two million to four or five million. 